In Texas, suicide is the second leading cause of death from ages 15 to 34. And did you know in Texas, suicide is the third leading cause of death from ages 10 to 14? And more than twice as many people in Texas die by suicide than by homicide. Join us September the 9th at the Del Mar Center for Economic Development as we officially kick off Suicide Prevention Month. Welcome back to Coastal Living. I'm here with Dr. Sissy reynolds Bettas and Representative Todd Hunter. Now what you just saw is a promotional video which you may have already seen on TV to raise awareness for suicide prevention and teasing the symposium that will be coming up. So tell me about this symposium. Well, this is our third symposium. The mm -hmm. first one we had was when we first started uh, the task force and started talking about some things that we wanted to get done and started informing everybody about what was uh, about suicide. Mm -hmm. The second one was to let everybody know that we were working on some things to propose as bills for or some bill proposals to for Todd Hunter to uh, move forward. Mm -hmm. And then this one is to show, okay, what has happened from the work. We've invited, uh, I've invited every principal that I know, every high school principal that I know, and uh, to bring 10 students. So we're going to have, and, and I'm still being contact for, mm -hmm. contacted about them wanting to bring some more students. Mm -hmm. So I know we're going to have a packed house of, of teenagers. Um, we're going to have close to 150 maybe teenagers there. Amazing. But we're also going to have many adults, mental health professionals, educators, veterans, uh, that are going to help guide the students. Mm -hmm. This symposium is going to be more of like a workshop. Mm -hmm. Um, for the students to get into tables and create activities that they're going to take back to their schools, their campuses, and uh, initiate with their principal uh, to occur during the month of September. Wonderful. Just to kick it off. Some conversation starters, some things to promote awareness, mm -hmm. um, to educate the students, the, the rest of their peers, about what they've been learning here at the symposium. Amazing. And Todd, tell me what is your takeaway from this experience? I know you're a big factor in making these big moves for us as a state. Um, tell me what your takeaway is from these events and when you see these children coming together and, and being so productive and raising awareness. Well, the key thing about this symposium is it's interactive. Mm -hmm. I mean, you don't need a bunch of just one group telling you what to do on suicide. Let's get everybody involved. Yes. We got parents, we got mm -hmm. veterans, we got kids. <laughs> Everybody's coming in. The best laws come from the people themselves. Yep. And if you want to stop something like suicide, let's talk about it. But let's get the people that can communicate mm -hmm. in that. Exactly. This whole program on Monday, it's coming up Monday, mm -hmm. the 9th is to get people there, let's talk about it, come up with ideas. But we're not just stopping Monday. Mm -hmm. We're continuing this. Program. Okay. We're also going to do a program later on just on veterans, the PTSD yes. issue. Mm -hmm. So there's a lot of moving parts. We're going to keep it alive. Sissy and the group have done a great job. And the students, as you see, are sending the message. Let's mm -hmm. open it up. If Texas and our community can be the model for the rest of the nation, maybe we can end it. Amen to that. And you mentioned Monday. Now tell me more details on Monday and how we're continuing that movement forward. From 8.30 to 12, we're going to be at the Del Mar Center for Economic Development. Okay. And um, we have so many people registered right now that we have an overflow room. Mm -hmm. It's going to have monitors there also Great. to make sure that it's still interactive. Mm -hmm. um, and, and you mentioned everyone's welcome to this? Yes. Absolutely. So not it's just free. students, veterans, no. mothers, daughters. It's free. Everyone in between. It's a free event, guys, so don't be shy. You're amongst <laughs> friends and family. Yes. And, okay. And sign up, if you can, on Eventbrite. Event, so right? That, so okay. that we can mm -hmm. make sure we're tracking everybody because yes. we want to make sure we got their names, addresses, yes. and contacts. But what I love is that you're not cutting it off at your max. You're making no. space, mm -hmm. which is a little simple, tiny task yes. for you to do to be inclusive and to help those people not feel like they missed the boat right. on finding help. Right. So and you'll we have start, that event. Yes, mm -hmm. and we started a Twitter page. Great. So it's at, at stop underscore, underscore TX. TX underscore suicide. Okay, so you can follow them on Twitter as mm -hmm. well. So from 8.30 to 12 mm -hmm. at the Del Mar Center for Economic Development, yes. correct? Uh -huh. And then what happens after that? Uh, well, then after that, the students go to lunch and mm -hmm. then they'll go back to their campuses. Okay. Hopefully feeling inspired. Uh, they're also going to be making anklets and bracelets cool. um, to pass out to their peers when they get back to campus. Mm -hmm. um, we made shirts for them last time, which is the one that they just showed right now on the mm -hmm. monitor. And uh, in the front, it has a suicide prevention hotline. Yes. And our students went back wearing those shirts. We gave them to um, all 100 students that were there last mm -hmm. time. 
I think we had almost 200 students last wow. time. And um, they went back to their campuses and they were wearing them and people were asking them, hey, where'd you get that it shirt? Starts the get that? It starts and the conversation. And that's what it's all about is and to take away that yeah. stigma. Yeah, exactly. Absolutely. Well, thank you, Dr. Sissy, thank for you. joining us and Todd Hunter for taking the Good time to be, to be here. here. And thank you so much for what you're doing for the community. I mean, this is a huge step for us. And guys, especially the parents out there, you may not be able to tell in your child's behavior. We were all children at some point in our lives. Start the conversation with them. Encourage them to go even as a mentor if they explain to you that they don't have those emotions mm -hmm. and experiences. For all you know, it could be something that they're trying to keep down. So make sure that we're all open to the conversation and welcoming to those who might be having a bad day, all right? You never know what little act of kindness is going to change somebody's entire life. Thank you for joining us, guys. Thank you. Up next, we'll tell you a few simple lifestyle changes that you can do to live a happier and healthier life. We'll be right back on Coastal Living. You're watching Coastal Living on KZTV, the only lifestyle show made in the Coastal Bend for the Coastal Bend. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back.